guys, welcome back to the NFA Review Channel. Today we're going to be reviewing the new Silencer Co. Hybrid. The first time you saw a sneak peek at this suppressor was uh, when I was down in the Keys with uh, Silencer Co. at their Max and Vice event. Um, I never got to shoot it because I was not feeling too well. I didn't have my sea legs and the Tactical Nomad who's filming right now had to step in and take care of business. So today you're going to see an up close look at it and you're going to see just how it performs. The hybrid, as the name suggests, is Silencer Co.'s answer to the multi-use suppressor market. It's rated for pistols, submachine guns and rifles, and big bores. Not only is it rated for the big bores, but it's hearing safe on them as well. 4570, hearing safe. 458 SOCOM, hearing safe. And small, compact, lightweight package. So uh, pretty impressed with it there. Let's go ahead and roll in some specs for you. The hybrid ships with a suppressor sock, a multi-use tool, two spanner wrenches, a piston housing with no included piston. You have to buy that separately. It does include the spring. And the 5 8 by 24 flat rear mount. The hybrid comes in at 7.8 inches in length, 1.565 inches in diameter, and weighs only 12.2 ounces, which is pretty impressive uh, considering it's rated for the big bore calibers that it is. In addition to the 5 8 by 24 direct thread mount, you have the ability to use the suppressor as a quick detach. This is the ASR system everyone's coming to love from the Specor series. To use it, thread it on till it shoulders and then turn the locking collar and your suppressor is now locked on tight and won't go anywhere. To assemble the piston housing, drop the piston into the housing, the spring on top of the piston, and then the retaining nut on the back. You'll have to push a little bit to get past the o-ring engagement. Tighten that down all the way and then once that's tightened, your housing is ready to be dropped in to the rear mount of the hybrid. Seat it all the way down and then to assure that it stays on and stable while shooting, use one of the includer spanner wrenches. Get a good snug there and ready to go try it on a pistol. We're going to roll in some decibel reading uh, specs off to the right. At the time of filming, we didn't have them on hand. Silencer Co. wasn't nice enough to drive down before the official data was released so all my fans out there can get an exclusive first look at the hybrid. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get shooting now. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, when we were on the Maxim Vice boat, I got a little sick. I didn't get to shoot it. So the Tactical Nomad got to have all the fun. Today it's my turn. Let's go ahead and get shooting. Shoot so soft.
baby. She good. Nice. Wow, that's...